Every Friday, we show you the positive stories in eastern Idaho of the people and the places we all appreciate. We call it the bright side, and tonight we start with local police officers receiving a huge honor. Two sergeants with the Bingham County Sheriff's Office have been given the Purple Heart. They also received a plaque of recognition signed by the president of the American Police Hall of Fame. Patrol Sergeant Todd Howell and Detective Sergeant Chad Kent received the award after being shot in the line of duty. In 2018, Howell was responding to calls of someone driving down the road shooting a gun. He was shot when he approached the shooter's home. Kent was shot last year while chasing a man who fled from a crash. Both sergeants say they were surprised and honored by the award. And this is the first time the Bingham County Sheriff's Office has given a Purple Heart. The Blackfoot Animal Shelter is doing their part to help in the aftermath of Hurricane Ian. The shelter took in nine dogs from Florida that were displaced by the hurricane. The dogs were in a shelter in Florida, were not microchipped, and were never claimed. They're now up for adoption at the Blackfoot Shelter. The last two summers, the shelter has also taken in animals affected by the fires in California. Farm Bureau Insurance donated $19,000 to the Idaho Food Bank. Its agents and other team members raised the money during a company-wide fundraising event. Since the food bank can provide up to four meals for every $1 donated, Farm Bureau's contribution will provide about 76,000 meals for Idahoans in need. And an Ammon student is getting paid for good grades. I wish I got that. Brindley Wright, of course, I wouldn't get much money, though, because of my grades. <laughs> yeah, Brindley Wright, yeah, if that. Brindley Wright from Thunder Ridge High School won a $500 savings account from Zion's Bank as part of it pays for A's drawing. As part of the program, students can earn a dollar for each A and then were entered into the large drawing for the savings account. And if you have an idea for the bright side, send us an email, newsroom at kpvi.com. We're interested in your positive stories about the people and the places of eastern Idaho.